Hello, it's Adrian Crawford, Williams Crawford, passion for Porsche. And uh, this is Walkabout Wednesday. I haven't done one for a little while, but um, briefly, it's a decent day here and we've got some really interesting Porsche. Let me take you inside and show you. Okay, well, let's, let me show you around. Um, we've got a good selection of Porsche turbos, uh, 997 and 996 turbos. This one, particularly nice look with a Porsche Aero kit. Really rare to see that. Um, Colour coded along the base of the sills. It's got the um, rear spoiler and inside is particularly special with a lot of carbon in there, extra leather. It's, uh, this would have been an exclusive option car. The cost of making these special um, options on these cars was enormous. So um, what you see there is a real rarity. And then beside it, I've got another rarity. Now 993 Targas didn't make so many of them. Not so many sold here in the UK. They are a really nice option with the panel that lifts off and the top that slides back underneath. It's a really good dual purpose car. But this particular one, polar silver, slight hint of blue in there, original split rim Targa wheels. It's done 9,400 miles. I've never had a 993 in that condition. I've had some really, really good ones here, but that one is just unbelievable. It's original, the dash, the clots, the leather, the wheels, everything underneath, just amazing. Um, behind it, 996 convertible, they're good value for money. A little 911 SC, which we've sold, and lovely Cayman in what looks like aqua blue. That's really nice. We've got um, our own 964C2 that'll go on the market soon with um, a few um, nice upgrades on it. And we could change the wrap on it if you liked, but um, I think it looks really wicked in the Rothmans colors. Got a little 356 uh, right-hand drive car. It's got quite a nice cool look and will be a good fun for someone. McCann's, we have a selection of them, and then mostly this is um, this is maintenance work cars. Let me um, take you inside and uh, show you what else is going on here. Well, we've always got Boxsters and Caymans here. We've got a super nice low mileage Club Sport MO30 car rather like this 981 with the red leather inside. That is super nice. That's a Boxster S with the PDK. A low mileage 996 turbo Tiptronic. I think that's got very good potential. Carrera 2 convertible in white is rare. New type 718 Boxster. Right hand drive 65. 997 Turbo. Gorgeous 993 Carrera 2S. This is one of the favorites. It's Arena Red. I hope you can see how nice this car is. The paint is gorgeous on it. Really good cars. 997 GTS. Let's check out the center lock wheels. Very, very nice car. I'm going to show you inside because these look fantastic. I don't know what it is, but the leather, the red belts, the trim on it. This is a PDK with a paddle shift. These cars had a lot of equipment on it. And this one is super nice. And then we've got another 997 here. Um, it's a Carrera 4S Gen 2 car. 
So uh, that'll have the wider body in the back. Obviously four wheel drive. Sweet 912. Early car, tobacco inside, Irish green. Oh, look at that. It does look sweet, doesn't it? And actually it drives really, really nicely. Um, you could fall in love with that. On to gorgeous racing yellow Cayman. It's a Cayman S, it's a manual gearbox. Um, lots of debate whether you want a manual or a PDK, but whatever you like is best. 991 Carrera 2T. I really like that car. It's a smoke silver rather than a straight silver. Beautiful spec, very low mileage, very, very nice indeed. Also quite keen on this, a 4S. Now you can see when you compare it to the 993 there, this again is the polar silver, so you can see the blue in it. And this costs £24,000, which seems to me like really good value. Another 996 Turbo, this time it's a turbo with the um, power upgrade option very rare to see that it's, uh, one of the one of the last of them seal gray 5s6 so the 5 is showing that it's a 2005 model year the car's done 33,000 miles as i say it's got the upgrade factory upgraded power very very nice indeed uh, Turbo Tiptronic. Do you like the black wheels? I think the black wheels suit that car. Look really, really nice, low mileage car. 99, no, not 99, it's a 911 Super Sport convertible from 88. So that's got the G50 gearbox and hydraulic clutch. Um, works, works turbo look, so the flared arches, wheels suspension of a normal 930 turbo this one's got the addition of the se style sills and front spoiler different to um different to a standard one and this would have been fitted in the day at the dealer um, that would have been uh, a rare option well, in fact this particular car was a special wishes car so it c those options could well have been done there. Um, it's uh, full leather inside, really clean, nice mileage, beautiful history. Sort of needs the sun to shine and we're lucky with that. Um, we've got a lovely uh, 911, 72 911 T slash E that's been sold. 993 convertible it's a carrera 4 it's also said to be judging by the paperwork the last right hand drive c4 cab available so this was registered in 98 to a local gentleman it's done nominal mileage i think 17,000 original miles and uh, something that should really be kept in beautiful shape because we're beginning to see these coming in for restoration clearly not in this condition this is an original car and uh, if it's looked after it'll never need it but 993s are beginning to turn up for restoration if you can buy a good original like the ones that we've got here then uh, uh, I think that's the way forward but if you need uh, work done on yours we're very knowledgeable about those cars. Um, this is a 964. Now we don't see too many 964s now. At one point, we used to have dozens of them. I had them in all types of colors and all types of models, but they're so seldom do you see good ones. And although I've said it before, it's, this is one of the best I've seen for probably 10 years. It's an original car look, so it's on its design 90 wheels, the flat wheels with the 
with the nine spokes. It's got the flag mirrors. That's the original style of mirror. It's sports seats inside. Black leather, piped red. It's even got its original blow pump stereo in it. And the door shut, cha chunk. That is the way they should be. So th these are, um, I still really enjoy a 964. And this one is an outstanding car. If you fancy one, then you ought to come speak to us about this. Uh, let's see where else we've got. We've got a really nice 911 Super Sport. At the time, these were, this is an early car, so it's from 85. This would have been known as an SSE rather than a Super Sport. It's in a sort of garnet red metallic. The original color, special order color, with a Bordeaux interior. And everything's been done on that car, and it does look fabulous and it drives just as well so very few of those cars were made because they cost within a whisker of a regular 930 turbo and uh, the last one in the showroom that I'm going to show you is this 911 3.2 it's a left-hand drive car I've owned it before supplied it a couple times this car's all about fun. It's on lightweight polycarbonate panels. It's got center filled tank. It's got suspension. It's wild. It's wacky and it is wonderful. It is great fun to use. Got some really nice kit on it, including these beautiful RSR style Fouche wheels. A big spoiler. It's very light. It's, sport, it's running a 3.2 fuel injected motor with a 915 gearbox. This car is fun all the way. An A64 ACV is the original number that I put on it when I imported it back in about 1998 from Germany. And at that point, it was a completely standard uh, forest green I think they call it. it might be oak green car just great fun for someone let me take you um, into the workshop so we've always got some good work going on here and uh, this uh, Carrera 4S is coming for inspection it's with another dealer it's up for sale and one of the things that we spotted was It's actually, those are the cords on the tire. So the tire is so worn that it's down to the carcass. And uh, if you have one of these, do note because the tires can feel okay when you sort of casually run your hand over them, but it's often the very inside edge. So it's worth every now and again taking a good look at yours and making sure that they're in good shape. Um, now, over here, We've got our Ian doing a fantastic job on this uh, KN that uh, we've just sold. He's using the Autoglim Life Shine treatment on it and it leaves it absolutely silky smooth and the paint work like a mirror. And although I was a disbeliever, I did this, um, or I had Ian do it to my car and I have to say, it makes cleaning it easier, it protects it, and the appearance is just that you've got the pleasure of seeing my face in it. And then the full protection goes to the inside of the car. It'll um, prevent it getting uh, dirty, stained, applied to the carpets, the seats, the glass. It's well worth having done. So new owner for this, should be really pleased and Ian does a super good job so let's have a look in the in our restoration department got some interesting cars in here little 54 bent screen 356 
it's sort of it does need help let's be fair but it's still got a brilliant look now that little car's been sleeping for a good long time um, we've got to assess it and then work out what a good plan is with it maybe it'll come into restoration or maybe it'll get sold and here we are um, putting back together one of our projects it's um, well I don't think I'll tell you what it is I'll let you guess but it is uber rare and over here looks to me like we've all but finished a build on the motor for it certainly pretty isn't it so we've had that apart refurbished it there's an incredible amount of work and detail that goes into this can't wait to see it all back in one piece so I hope you enjoyed our walkabout it's um, all I've got for you this week and uh, watch out for some more I'm gonna try and get back on to the plan of continuously making our little tours and focusing on different aspects of what we do here at Williams Crawford passion for Porsche if uh, you need anything done give us a call if you'd like to buy a car or sell a car sell a car then you know where we are please get in touch <laughs>